So the first step is to uh, install this ins extension. So which I hope most of you would have done. I mean, that's how you would have been uh, redirected to this video. And uh, after that, you should, I mean, the next step is to go to www.swiggy.com. And uh, I have not logged in right now. So I am logging in and giving the phone number. I am getting a OTP. Yeah, logging is successful. So after that, you have to go to this orders page. So now you are in this orders page. Click this extension icon and then let's click for one year. Yeah, sometimes sometimes this doesn't work. So when this doesn't work, what you do is you just refresh this page, refresh the same orders page and click this extension icon and then click one year. I, I will work on fixing that glitch in the next update. So most probably it should be done, should be fixed by the end of this month. So if you see the orders are being fetched, all the orders are being fetched and it is currently showing uh, order start six for the past one year. So the first chart is the monthly spending. So the green bars are um, what you paid Swiggy after the discounts and uh, I mean the orange bars are what I mean uh, it's before the discounts. So these are the top 10 restaurants and top 10 foods and these are the delivery time charts. So if you see um, orange is Swiggy's promised delivery time and uh, green is actual delivery time. Sometimes they are fast, sometimes they are slow. See, if you see this, they have taken 94 minutes and but they have promised 39 minutes. But here they have promised 40 minutes, but they have actually taken only 17 minutes. So this is just a chart. And uh, the next one is what percentage of your orders are delivered on time. This is the late orders for me. It's 20.77% late orders, which I mean, 80% on time orders is, I would say it's very good. And then the next, the next section will just show you the fastest order that, uh, you've ever placed and then the slowest order. And the next section shows the fastest restaurants and the slowest restaurants. So all these information is for the past one year. So since we have fetched all the orders, when we uh, initially picked, I mean, when we initially picked the date, date range, I mean, so the next time when you want to say, let's say you want to see the stats for two years, it will instantly refresh. So you can just play around by changing the date range. You can see that it gets updated instantly. So yeah, that's it. So if you have any uh, feedback or I mean any improvements that you would like to see on the, I mean on this extension, you can please email on India apps. Uh, I forgot the email. You can check the, I'll just, I'll just check. <laughs> Fuck. That's the email. Ah, yeah, it is indiaapps.in at gmail.com. So yeah, that's it. Thank you.